I love my experience at the College of Education. Uh, not only do they prepare us by sending us out into the field so often throughout our time there, but we also have a lot of courses grounded in uh, psychology, sociology, even uh, anthropology to a certain extent. So you're not just sitting there planning lessons all the time, you're actually getting exposure to different types of cultures and different types of people. And the professors, for the most part, are all like right on the cutting edge of everything, the newest technology. I think it's definitely a school that's known for over-preparing people for their actual experience as teachers. I think principals and superintendents, administrators, and um, all of those people in the education world feel very sh passionately about hiring students from Seton Hall and very passionately about hosting students from Seton Hall in their uh, experience, clinical experiences. Um, every administrator principal I've spoken to, when they ask me where I go to school, Seton Hall, it's always like with a smile, like go Pirates. Everyone, everyone knows Seton Hall, whether it's for basketball or for the academics. And a lot of teachers that I've worked in the same school as are actually Seton Hall graduates too. So it's very popular in the education world from what I've experienced. From what I've heard and from what I've seen talking to other student teachers, we do here at Seton Hall offer more opportunities for field placements prior to the actual student teaching experience. And I think with that comes uh, like a very like, strong sense of comfort when it comes to being in front of the classroom. My experience transferring to Seton Hall from County College of Morris is very positive. I had the Dean of Transfer students uh, there at my disposal pretty much any time I had a question. I also had the veteran representative there all the time to answer my emails and help out with the GI Bill and the Yellow Ribbon Program. Um, my professors sat down with me at orientation one-on-one -on -one and helped me plan my schedule, so it was very, it was, it was a seamless transition. I think my experience at Seton Hall has changed me. It definitely has made me more, uh, take my work more seriously. I think a lot of that has to do with just like the encouragement of the professors and uh, just the community feel in the classrooms. It's not like a competition, it's kind of everyone helps each other out and it kind of make, encourages someone like me to want to do well. And I feel like Seton Hall, although it's a very small school, it is a very like diverse school. You see a lot of different people from a lot of different backgrounds and with that you have more exposure to uh, diverse ways of thinking or just other ways of thinking that wouldn't necessarily be your own. Uh, in the classroom too, so that was a big reason why I chose Seton Hall. After graduation, I'll be accepting a Fulbright grant uh, to teach English in Malaysia for a year, and I'm really excited about that. And I think that I feel very lucky that Seton Hall has a very strong faculty uh, committee that helps out students with not only Fulbright grants, but with other prestigious scholarships as well. And it was a long process, it was a six month process, and they were there every step of the way. I don't think I ever would have gotten it had I gone to a different school, to be honest with you. I love Seton Hall because I feel very comfortable here. Uh, I love the fact that there's Dunkin' Donuts in the library. I don't have to go anywhere to get coffee. Uh, but most of all, I think I love the fact that everyone here moves with some sort of uh, purpose or determination. And feeding off that energy kind of like inspires me to do the same. So I don't think I would have taken school as seriously had I not been in a community like this.